What is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Full Nelson, your host that eats the most. And this is another episode of Full Nelson Eats A Lot. Uh, thanks for coming back to the channel. I'm outside of Burger King right now. We're gonna try some brand new bacon cheesy tots. I'm excited, let's do it. Let me know when you're ready. Uh, could I do uh, order the bacon cheesy tots, please? And uh, that'd be it. My second one Thank you. No ooh, 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 ooh. I'm excited. All right, cheesy bacon tots. A little expensive. Well, more expensive than I was expecting. Cause you get ten chicken nuggets here for a buck forty nine, uh, but you get eight cheesy bacon tots for two nineteen. So it's like seventy cents more for two less. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> 237. Here you go. Thanks. Do you recommend anything for them on the side, like ketchup, ranch, or something? You know what? All right. That's what people are saying. All right, cool. Some different stuff. Can I do a ranch? Yeah. And I guess a buffalo too. I, just one is fine. Thanks, you're awesome. Appreciate it. All right. Got a few dipping sauces. You know I do it for y'all. So let's see what it is. I got a buffalo, a ranch, and um, a zesty sauce. So big shout out to the great staff here at Burger King, man. Y'all really make me keep coming back because of the good service I hope these cheesy bacon tots are fresh hot and delicious let's park put that thing in park <laughs> unbuckle and let's get down to business we've got the buffalo we've got a ranch and we've got a zesty sauce, zesty sauce. Has horseradish as one of the first ingredients. So, I think I can, I know what I'm expecting there. Ooh wee. We got the uh, cheesy bacon tots right here. They're in there. Let's uh, lower the AC so you can hear me a little better. Bust that thing open. Ooh wee. They've got a nice golden color. They're definitely hot. I feel that heat from them. Um, not just out of the fryer, but very recently out of the fryer. So here's what we're gonna do, y'all. Let me grab one of these cheesy bacon tots. I'm gonna bite into it and see what it's all about on its own. And then we're gonna try it with all three different sauces. Mm. Mm. these are pretty good let me get you guys a close up of these cheesy bacon tuts golden crisp on the outside rip into one you see that cheesiness in that bacon Mm. soft potato filling on the inside I do get that cheesiness We'll go with the ranch first I do get that bacon flavor but I'll tell you one thing it's not loaded with the bacon pieces I get the bacon flavor throughout the cheesy tot the cheesy bacon tot but I'm not getting the bacon texture and chunks there's maybe like one to two chunks in each little cheesy bacon tot
and that might be enough for some people but me I need a little more bacon in here if anything just for the meatiness and texture but as far as flavor goes it does have the bacon flavor really good with the ranch I got recommended by one of my favorite peeps at Burger King to try the zesty so let's try the zesty this one has a nice little orange color to it I'm gonna bring you guys in for a close-up of the dunk let's do it that thing dunk mm. got the zesty sauce mmm mmm zesty sauce is super good the zestiness kind of kicks up the flavor of the bacon a little bit and complements it and kicks it up a little and then it still has that same creaminess that I enjoyed from the ranch but uh, of course a different flavor and that zestiness really goes nice with the cheese and bacon it really helped the bacon kind of stand out a little more let's try with the buffalo this is the last sauce I got pick three sauces that I thought would go good I think you have pretty good odds and chances there if you get three sauces and a product that a restaurant comes out with does not taste good with any of those three sauces then you need to get rid of that thing I mean one out of three sauces has got to be good Let's try this out again. Ooh. Less creamy. Mm. The buffalo is my least favorite. Didn't really go good with those. But the ranch and the zesty really, really complemented this. Uh, it made it taste really good. Definitely would recommend for all y'all out there. I'm on my sixth one. They give you eight. I can say that. You know, for $2.19, they're not bad at all. They're much cheesier than before, which I really, really like. Previously, I had had the cheesy tots. They didn't have the bacon yet, but the cheesy tots I had needed more cheese. They did well with these. They added more cheese, but since these are bacon cheesy tots, I think we need a little more bacon. Just give us a couple more chunks per bite. I think we'll be all right. Um, Really, each one I had probably had like one or two pieces of bacon and that was it. That's not enough. We need a little more bacon if you're gonna call these cheesy bacon tots. All right, Burger King? Otherwise, pretty good. Worth the money? Yes. Still had that bacon flavor in every bite. And they were hot and cheesy, crispy on the outside. And uh, I think it's a little pricey. I would have liked this to be at maybe $1.99 for the eight pack uh, I paid 219 for the eight pack so 
not too far off but just a little, maybe about 10% more than I'd like to pay but otherwise still not bad that's it for my review of Burger King's new cheesy bacon tots here at Burger King I hope you enjoyed this video if you did do me a huge favor smash that like button let YouTube know that I'm doing a good job if this is your first time here to the channel and you like the content maybe think about subscribing I drop new food reviews and food related videos every single week and uh, maybe tap the bell so you don't miss a thing. Thanks to everybody joining the Boom Squad. I had a lot of fun with this video, and I'll see you on the next one. Boom! My guys ain't got my back. We booming in. You don't do that, so see a way out. Follow me on Instagram at Fool Nelson Eats. You might like what you see. You might want to put it in your mouth. Talking about that meat. Ha! Talking about that food pick, dog. But you think disgustingly. But I ain't gonna really think about that. I ain't got no time to waste. So I'm trying to get a bag. Talking about that bag of money. Not that bag of chips that you always be with on the couch.